What's up guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to customize your Logitech G910 lighting on it to change it. So yeah, so you're going to go to the link I have in the description below. If not, you just go to support.logitech.com from here and then you scroll down and it says 32-bit um, but you, you can choose to go to show all downloads. Go to Windows, whichever Windows you're on. So, but I'm on Windows 10, so I'm gonna click Windows 10, and it shows all of them. You're gonna want to choose the first one for your Logitech keyboard. So you click download, but I already have it downloaded, so I'm not gonna download it. So once you finish collecting all the data, meaning you downloaded everything up to the point where you can open it up, that's good. So now you have it opened up, right? You click to this little light bulb right here, and it should show you this. Your keyboard going crazy like mine but mine i have my settings fixed to what i want on mine so on this you can click any of these this one lighting mode it just lets you choose which ones you want on your keyboard to be lighted you can change it or whatever you want it'll change to that on your keyboard right like i can just like do this and this make them black or white or whatever you want right and then you can also do sections. So say I click red, I click and drag all of this. That's gonna turn red. Go to blue, click and drag all of this, turns blue. Go to yellow, click and drag all of this, and it turns yellow. And then if you would look at your keyboard, it does the same thing. This one, the second one, the one to the right, it's called zones. That one you can click whatever you wanna do with it. So I click red, I can turn that set, those keys into red, or I just, you click them once, they change the color. You click them twice, it takes the color off. You could do that with any color. Yellow, like H, J, K, they're all yellow. Click them again, they're not yellow no more. You could do that for whatever key you want to turn, or whatever color you want to turn. Now for commands, there's not really anything you can do, but... I'm pretty sure it's just for you to use while you're in your games so that you don't click this key right here mid-match and you screw yourself over in that game. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I do that in my games too sometimes. And then the last one, effects. Effects is the one you're going to like the most for sure. Unless you don't want some, some, some like lagginess on your face, you know, you don't want to, you want to get um, glitched out and shit. So fixed color is just one certain color right here, right? It just changes the own color: red, orange, yellow, green, purple. Not that cool. I don't think it's that cool. And then you could go to breathing. Breathing is just changing the color. It's literally the same. Your same color. It just stays on one color. It's all I'm gonna say. You can change the color of what you want it to be on. And then there's an option to go slower or faster. Faster is this. It's the fastest you can go. Slower. Just go super slow. And then there's the middle. It's like normal rate. And then you can choose like where to go in between both of them. Between medium and fast. Slow and medium. It's whatever you want. Your preferred thing. Okay. The second option is star effect. Not my favorite, but still, I think it's pretty cool. You can do, uh, let's say, pink for the star colors, the ones that can, uh, that are going to glow up to be those colors. And then sky color is just uh, how the other ones are going to be. So I'm pretty sure I can change those to red too. See? And then on your keyboard, they light up differently. So I can probably put this white so it looks way more better than what it is. Or probably black. So you can see it better. It's whatever you guys want. The next section is going to be color cycle. It's just literally just the color cycle. All you, in this one, all you got to do is you can change the speed of it. It's going to be the fastest, the slowest, medium, medium fast, medium slow, medium, whatever you want. Not that cool. And then color wave. This is the one I have on my keyboard. And direction, if you click down the little hop bar section, you can go to horizontal. That makes it go from left left to right. 
you go to vertical from the top to bottom and then center out is my favorite it's from the center you keyboard and it just shows all your colors to the left if I put it on slow you guys can see that it it goes from the center of where O, P, L, and semicolons are at from there and it continues out I have mine on the fastest because I think it looks cool going fast and yeah that's for that one then key press this one I don't really like this one this one it just lights up when the when you press the keys on your keyboard then they fade away slowly after a while like I'll put the background color white right because why not then on your keyboard when you look at it and you start pressing keys it changes to that color that you have a preset on and it fades away so say I put pink right if I click any of my keys on your keyboard they'll turn the color you have on it yeah that pretty much sums it all up and yeah thanks for watching guys see you all in the next video peace